Hey lovelies, welcome back to my channel. It's me, Herlikim again. Today's video will be all about another hair tool that has been around for almost a year now, which is the Dry Bar Double Shot Blow Dryer. This has recently piqued my interest because just last week I also reviewed another hairbrush tool and many of you requested that I review this blow dryer as well. It's a popular blow dryer brush that gives you that perfect blowout. And of course, as a response to your requests, I will be dispensing my honest review on this tool based on specs, warranty, price, and performance. And to have a reliable base for performance, I will start with my hair fresh from the shower. So let's go ahead with the review and I'll be right back. Aloha, I'm back. As you guys have noticed, I have extremely thick, wavy hair, and if I don't use the right tool, my hair could easily turn into a lion's mane. Is this tool worth it? That's what we're going to find out today. And before I start, I usually apply heat protecting spray and frizz control serum, and then I partition my hair to save some time. So now I will set the timer on so you guys can see how long it takes to blow dry my hair, and the timer starts now. This brush combines a blow dryer and a round brush into one tool to create a smooth and shiny blowout. This has a tangle-free cord which makes it easier to maneuver. To turn it on, rotate the power setting controller to the left and choose from the three heat settings accordingly. Cool airflow, low power airflow which is best for fine to medium hair, and high power airflow which is best for medium to thick hair. The brush is also incorporated with nylon and tufted bristles on each side of the brush to help the brush have a better grip on the hair. And the oval shaped barrel is coated with ionic mineral which is meant to give you that shinier and frizz free hair. It comes in a bright yellow color which I really like and the handle grip feels comfortable to hold. This tool retails for 198 Canadian dollars and has a 2 year warranty. Alright I'm back with my hair done, it took me 26 minutes and 25 seconds to blow dry my hair. Okay so this tool is even lighter than the Amica blow dryer. Off the bat, I noticed that my hair is extremely smooth. Just make sure that when you are working on the roots, position your brush right where there are nylon and tufted bristles so that it grips onto your hair. I've also noticed that the brush has definitely added more volume to my hair. Since I have thick hair, I don't think I need that extra volume, but if you're someone with a flat hair type, then this brush would definitely be a good tool to have. Also, while I'm a big fan of the color yellow, what I don't like is that it can easily get dirty or it can easily get noticeable makeup smudges. Not a big deal, but it just perks up my OCD-ness. And another thing, with the cool airflow temperature, which is the lowest setting, I was expecting that cool air would come out, but it was the opposite. It was still warm, so I don't know what to think about that. Overall, I'm really happy with the results. The amount that you pay for this product justifies its performance, and this one does not disappoint. This brush tool gave me that at-home blowout that I was expecting to get from this tool. Alright guys, that's it for today's video. I hope this review somehow helped you decide if you are indeed planning to get a blow dryer brush that fits that $200 budget. Also, do check out my other hair tool review videos on my channel and see how it compares to this one. If there's a certain comparison video you guys want to see that I haven't done yet, let me know in the comments below. And if you like this, please don't forget to smash that like button, share it with your friends, maybe someone you know is looking for that perfect hair tool and this could be it. Also, subscribe and hit that bell icon to get notified of my upcoming uploads if you haven't already. We are so close to reaching 1000 subscribers, so stay tuned for a giveaway. I will be posting a video with regards to the mechanics when we reach that milestone. I will be saying goodbye for now and I'll see you lovelies on my next video. Bye!